Hello, welcome back to some more side questing. There are some requests posted on the blackboard. We're gonna check both of them. We've got what a massive mushroom. Moral the mushroom hunter is curious about the mushroom growing on Parasect's back. Please assist him investigating. And then we've got a nose pass to guide the way. Gully of the Supply Corps has requested help. Something to do with a saying about a nose pass. Seek around and put your surveying skills to good use by pointing her in the right direction. Okay. So, we are going to let us check out that nose pass one. I do need to find two more crunchy salt for one of these two. Oh, and it gives me a black augurite and, EX, and an EXP candy. But let's do this one first. It does look like the uh, space-time distortion kind of fizzled. All right, so it looks like we're going out. And we are going here. Let's go to the Highlands camp. And where are we? Oh! Huh, good. I've been waiting for someone from the Survey Corps to come along. I want to gather crafting materials in Wayward Cave, but I realized I have a bit of a problem. My sense of direction is worse than useless. If there's any chance at all of getting lost in the cave, you can bet that's what I'll do. But I know a way to keep myself from stumbling around in the dark forever. See, there's an old saying in my hometown, a nose pass never wanders. Since nose pass always face in the same direction, people my, from my village would look to this Pokemon for guidance when they're lost, when they lost their way. Though I admit I've not actually seen a nose pass before in my life, but little matter. I just need to find myself a nose pass before I find myself hopelessly lost. I'll check the direction to face it against my map, then navigate through the cave with ease. I'll look around for a nose pass too, but if you catch one before I do, can you give it to me? Where'd you go? Okay. Yeah, we can. I got a couple nose pass, so we can give her one. And she's down there. So that's where we gotta go. I always do that. Kelly is apparently in here somewhere. Follow the torches, I assume. Hmm? Oh. And for some strange reason, I wanted to summon Sneasler in here. Hello. Did you find a nose pass for me? And nose pass. That's a nose pass, all right. Thanks for finding it. Now, as I understand it, this Pokemon's giant nose always points in the same direction. So it's, if it's facing this way, that means the exit must be over here. A nose pass never wanders indeed. I wish I'd encountered this Pokemon sooner. I'll you a big thanks. It's such a relief to finally have a nose pass as my trusty guide. All the twists and turns of Wayward Cave can't stop me now. There we go. So that takes care of that mission. Let's see here. Wait. Are there... Oh, there's one over here. We're gonna make our make our way that way. Let's see what that person's got for us. We have quelled four of the noble Pokemon now. So there's one to go. I know what it is. And he is pretty brutal. Okay, we're gonna... We're gonna just go this way. 
and I just walked into a whole bunch of fucking uh, Luxios. Is it back in town? Oh, duh. I'm following a dot and not the frickin' uh... Flag. I swear, I'm good at video games. <laughs> Bunch of Zubats and Golbats over here, too. I think this will give us another camp. I'm not sure. There's Gully with the nose pass. That's Volo. No, it's not. Oh, you're part of the Galaxy team. I've been waiting. I came here since I heard you all were planning to set up a camp. But it seems not much progress has been made since that Bronzor is getting in the way. It's not belligerent, but it seems like it wants something. So we can't just ignore it either. Please, do you think you can find out what it is that Bronzor wants? Yes. And in the meantime, I'll kept, I'll get that thing. Bra whatever Bronzor wants is this way. What it wants, I don't know. This will be so much better when I have Braviary. And it's snowing. Let's go up here. You're kidding me. That's just leading me back out. It's because it keeps putting me back to that mission. Sometimes I can't... Sometimes this game drives me crazy. Bonnets and the iron. And what what you got for me, Bronzor? Zor. Is there something over that way? See a Psyduck? I see a Bronzor. Zor. 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 I saw Bronzor go flying off in this direction all of a sudden. What in the. That Bronzor, it's wounded! This is no good at all. Here, I'll fix it right up. 
There. That should do it. Bronzor should be fit as a fiddle now. Zor. Zor. Seems the Bronzor at the new campsite was looking for its friend this whole time. I'm glad you looked into it. Otherwise, we may have been too late to treat this Bronzor. This land is dangerous, even for the Pokemon they, that call it their home. It may be wise to be extra prepared as you explore this area. I'll be sure to keep a fine lineup of wares stocked for you, so please buy anything that you need. Ah, uh, and it seems the base camp has been all set up while we were talking, in which case, I should get settled in there as well. So long! Yeah, we're gonna... We're gonna see if there's any other missions here. There are not. We are going to go... Right, I'm being targeted. And I died. Okay, so that's my first death. Fall damage exists. Bound to happen. All good. It seems you were rescued. Yeah, no shit. We're gonna use this uh, XP candy. Baro leveled. Let's do some shopping really fast. We're going to buy 12 great balls. We're going to buy... How many super potions could I buy? 81. We don't need 81. We're going to buy 19 super potions. And we're going to buy 5 revives. Should have the stuff to craft a bunch of uh, feather balls. Yeah, I got the stuff to buy 18 of them. I'm good on other balls. I did catch some Pokemon, so let's do that. Caught another duck. Come on. All right. All right, I still have 30... Or I still have like 1,700 points before I hit rank 5, so I might have to do some uh, post-game shenanigans um, or post-video vi shenanigans. Okay. Here we go. Something about Parasect. From this person over here. It just means on occasion, too, I'll have to watch to see if uh, they got my satchel back. It seems some of my fellow mushroom enthusiasts are looking into a fungus that sprouts from the back of a certain Pokemon. Parasex its name, I think. If you manage to catch one, I'd love to take it off your hands and do some research on my own. As a mushroom foraging veteran of 20 years, I aim to keep my finger on the beating pulse of all fungal fact-finding endeavors, after all. Oh my god, that's an alliteration. Do you have a Parasex for me? I should. This is a lovely mushroom and all, but where's the parasect you promised me? You can't be saying the mushroom is actually the parasect. Hi. Yeah. The mushroom. It turned around. Oh, oh no. You're saying the thing is a Pokemon, not a mushroom. And yet, call the forager's intuition, but 20 long years of picking tells me something is amiss. Yeah, I'm sure of it. The thing just that turned, just look at me just now, it's definitely a mushroom. Huh, 
Hey, had you for a minute there. Please forgive my shroom humor, but could you imagine? Parasect. To think, a Pokemon that's really just a mushroom. Such a thing is the stuff of fiction, right? And there we go. I did three missions, so that's going to be it for this video. I thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Take care. Peace.